Super Mario Bros. is a platform video game developed and published by Nintendo, the successor to the 1983 arcade game Mario Bros. It was released in Japan in 1985 for the Famicom and in North America and Europe for the Nintendo Entertainment System, 1985 and 1987 respectively. Players control Mario or his brother Luigi in the multiplayer mode as they travel through the Mushroom Kingdom to rescue Princess Toadstool from the antagonist, Bowser. They must transverse side they must traverse side scrolling stages while avoiding hazards such as enemies and pits, with the aid of power ups such as Super Mushroom, Fire Flower, and Star Man. The game was designed by Shigemoto, who is a Japanese video game designer and producer for the video game company Nintendo, currently serving as one of its representative directors. He is best known as the creator of some of the most critically acclaimed and best-selling video games and franchises of all times, such as Mario, The Legend of Zelda, Star Fox, F-Zero, Donkey Kong, and Pikmin. Miyamoto originally joined Nintendo in 1977 when the company was beginning its foray into video games and starting to abandon the playing cards it had since 1889. His games have been prominently showcased and widely anticipated as flagship titles in every Nintendo video game console, with his earliest work appearing on arcade machines in the late 1970s. He managed Nintendo's Entertainment Analysis and Development Software Division, which developed many of its company's first-party titles. The Nintendo Entertainment Analysis and Development Division, commonly abbreviated as Nintendo EAD, formerly Nintendo Research and Development for a Department, was formerly the largest software development dis was formerly the largest development division inside of Nintendo. It was preceded by the Creative Department, a team of designers with backgrounds in art responsible for many tasks, to which Shigeru Miyamoto and Takashi Tezuki originally belonged. Takashi Tezuki is a video game producer and executive officer working for Nintendo. A graduate of the de design department of the Osaka University of Arts, he joined the company in April 1984 and was involved with some of the most critically acclaimed Nintendo series, including Mario and The Legend of Zelda. Mario is a franchise published and produced by a video game company called Nintendo, starring a fictional Italian character Mario. It is primarily a video game franchise, with the friends other forms of media including several television series and a feature film. The first game, and the game we'll be focusing on today, is Super Mario Bros. for the entertainment system. Super Mario Bros. is frequently cited as one of the greatest video games of all time. With praise going towards its precise controls, it has, over, it has sold over 40 million physical copies, also making it one of the best-selling games of all time. It is credited alongside the NES as one of the key factors in reviving the video game industry after the 1983 crash. The video game crash of 1980 also known as the Atari Shock in Japan, was a large-scale recession in the video game industry that occurred from 1983 to 1985, primarily in America. The crash was attributed to several factors including market saturation in the number of game consoles and available games, and waning interest in console games in favor of personal computers. Revenues peaked from about $3.2 billion in 1983, then fell to around $100 million in 1985. The crash was a serious event which abruptly ended what is retrospectively considered the second generation of console video gaming in America. Lasting about two years, the crash shocked the then booming industry and led to a bankruptcy of several companies including home computers and video game consoles in that region. Analysts of the time expressed doubts with the long-term viability of video game consoles and software. The North American video game console industry eventually recovered a few years later, mostly due to the widespread success of the Nintendo Entertainment System <coughs> in 1985. Nintendo designed the NES with the Western branding for its Famicom console originally released in 1983 in order to avoid the missteps which caused the 1983 crash and avoid the stigma which video games had at the time. Ugh. Okay, the main flooded console market. Spurred by the su success of Atari VCS, other consoles were introduced both from Atari and other com companies. Atari 5200 
At the Atari 5200 Super System, commonly known as the Atari 5200, is a home video game console that was introduced in 1982 by Atari Inc. as a high-end complementary console to the Atari 2600. The 5200 was developed by Intellivision, but wound up directly competing with the ColecoVision shortly after its release. 5200's eternal hardware is almost identical to that of Atari's 8-bit computers. Although software is not directly Com compatible with the two systems. The 5200's controllers have an analog joystick. The, a joystick is an input device consisting of a stick that pivots at the base and reports its angle and direction to the device it's controlling. A joystick, also known as the control column, is the principal control device in the cockpit of many civilian and military aircraft, either a center stick or side stick. It often has supplementary switches to control various aspects of the aircraft's flight. Joysticks are often used to control video games, and usually have one of the more push buttons whose state can also be read by the computer. There are many manufacturing companies in the United States right now, including Toshiba, Asus, Compaq, HP, IBM, ThinkPad, Toughbook, uh, Lenovo, in Intel, NVIDIA, and, and more. Um, so Super Mario Brothers, built on these past, uh, past indiscretions in the industry. In Super Mario Bros, the player takes on the role of Mario, the protagonist in the series, and Mario's younger brother Luigi. Uh, we gotta introduce Luigi. L Luigi is a fictional character featured in video games and related media released by Nintendo. Created by a prominent game designer, Shigeru Miyamoto, Luigi is portrayed as a slightly younger but taller fraternal twin brother of Nintendo's mascot, Mario. Fraternal twins, also referred as non-identical twins, dissimilar twins, biovelular twins, and informally in the case of females, sororal twins, usually occur when two fertilized eggs are implanted in the uterus wall at the same time. When two eggs are independently fertilized by two different sperm cells, fraternal twins result from the two eggs, or ova, form two zygoids, hence the term the zygotic and biovelar. Fraternal twins are, essentially, two ordinary siblings who happen to be born at the same time, since they arise from two separate eggs fertilized by two separate sperm, just like ordinary siblings. So that's Luigi. And Luigi is controlled by the second player in the game's multiplayer mode. A multiplayer video game is a video game in which one or more person can play the same game environment at the same time, either locally or over the internet. During its history, video games have often been single player only activities. A single player video game is a video game where input from only one player is expected throughout the course of the gaming session. A single player game is usually a game that can be played by one person, while single player mode is usually a game mode designed to be played by a single player, though the game usually contains multiplayer modes. So basically, Super Mario Bros. was a game that started the gaming industry. And also, it sucks ass and it's old. Uh, and if you like it, you should fucking kill yourself. Uh, this has been the Epic Gamer signing off. Thanks for watching.